Hi everyone, Basil Chapman, Tiger Technicians Hour just completed and we're about to go into the 11 o'clock Tiger Financial News Network market update. And the Dow is uh, now down 57. It's really improving over the morning at 31,933. We want to see a leg D above 32,219, preferably this week. And then we have to reassess. But so far, the technicals are still very strong. But the S&P did take a little bit more of a dive it is trying to come back now. It's down 25. It's still down pretty sharply. This is going to be a more of a struggle. You want to see the four th the 39,000. Ooh, I'd even say on a short-term basis, 39,063 would be a very good sign. You're looking at the QQQ, and we need the Qs to come back. Um, they're down uh, 3.66 at 296.56. It held the 14-period moving average, and the green is still way above it, and that's a positive for the QQQ IWM. Russell 2000 is trading. Uh, now it's uh, down 59, says at 179.85, acting quite well. Gold, let's see if gold's come back a little bit. Gold is still uh, down a dollar and a half. It's holding quite well considering where the dollar is, but it's not breaking out. It's really struggling to break out. The technicals are very slowly improving, but you're not getting an improvement in price. Look at the dollar. Dollar is now up 62 ticks at 107.06. Not bad action. Crude oil. Holding very well at the lower end of the, the range. It's up 50 cents at 97.20. It's natural gas that really took off. And natural gas is up three, th 37 cents at 8.94. This is a spectacular move. Intradated 9.41 on the continuous contract, pulling back a little bit. And we're looking at the TLT. I didn't do that during my show, the Tiger Technicians. Oh, I should have. Didn't. I'm making a little double top here in the 119.24 area. It's up 90 cents. So that's telling us that yields are starting to come down. I did want to do a lot of things with the commodities, etc., and I did not. And as a result, I might. Let's see. We're waiting to see if Larry is able to make it today. If Larry isn't able to make it, I'll then another minute or two. I might be able to do his show at 11. It won't be uh, Larry Pesavento's trade what you see. It will be Basil Chapman with his analysis, but it will be using up that hour. And I'm going to be going through commodities. I'm going to be going through the currencies, uh, etc. So we'll see what happens. I haven't heard just yet to finalize it. We'll see another minute or two. We'll know whether Larry's in the house. We hope that Larry's in the house. But if he's not, I, I've set aside the hour that I'll be able to take to cover a whole bunch of things that I wasn't. I want to do bonds as well. So I might be back in another minute or two. Hope you can stay. Great programming. Yeah, we'll be back with Tom Layton Soft uh, for you.